Hey everybody, Miss Trish here for another episode of Coffee Chronicles, but this time I'm doing the movie review edition. First, explain where this comes from very quickly before I get right into it because I don't want to keep you long. So I used to do movie reviews a long time ago with my bestie on our show called Review Nation. And now I started doing them again on our Thursday morning radio show from 7 a.m. to 9 a.m., um, the Empower Hour. And so far, so good. The reviews have been great. I'm supposed to do one on Who Killed Sarah, but that is like coming, I promise. But today I'm going to start with a movie that I previously watched. It's called The Lie. So let's get into so it. So here we have The Lie, my first movie review, like I was telling you guys about. So let me just read what it says here. When their teenage daughter confesses to impulsively killing her best friend, two desperate partners cover up the horrific crime with a web of lies and deception. So I'm going to break down this movie just a little bit for you just a little bit more because um, there's something Canadian based about it. So The Lie is a Canadian, see, American psychological horror film written and directed by Vina Sud. The film is a remake of the 2015 German film called We Monsters. The Lie premiered at the Toronto International Film Festival on September 13th, 2018. It was later released on October 6, 2020 by, as you can see, Amazon Studios. Now, here is my honest review about this movie. I'm going to be honest and say that if you haven't, if you're having, like my West Indian is going to come in. I'm telling you guys, I can't, I can't deny it for this one. If you having a bad day and you want to cuss out a movie, this is the movie to cuss. This right here is the one. If you have a hot temper and you're just like, man, I'm having, I just want to cuss something, but you just don't want to get on nobody's nerves. This right here is the movie to do it. I suggest that it would be best to have a drink of rum or wine with this movie because when you see the outcome of this, you're going to be mad. For my West Indians, you're going to be vexed. And, and I promise you, you guys are going to want to slap all of the characters, and that's universal, any nationality that you are. Now, this movie, it totally makes you appreciate growing up in the 80s if you did, and actually not having social media to dabble in. So, if you have high blood pressure or a short fuse, I'm going to tell you that this movie is a Dawn Penn. No, no, no. But then you can watch it at your own discretion. But you know what? Let me know if you do watch it and what you think. Okay, so that was this episode of Coffee Chronicles Movie Review. Told you I'm trying to expand and do different things. But let me know if you end up watching The Lie. Let me know if you've watched it. And let me know what other movies you want me to review for my own take. Right now, I'm in the midst of watching a few series, so I'm going to get into that. I'm going to have some guests on. We're going to talk about that. And we're just going to keep it going and keep it moving because that is what we do around here. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Watch my other Coffee Chronicles videos. They are all on YouTube, honey. If you haven't subscribed yet, I don't know what you're waiting for, but you better do it soon. Miss Trish TV, and you can also go to my website, www that all things mistrish.com for my digital products and more i love you guys thanks for watching my first movie review like i said more to come Mwah. much love to you and i will see you guys again 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 very soon <laughs>